making more music. La! Hi. Hi. Okay. What is up, I'm Hillette. This is me, I'm a doing I'm a doing TV, and we are here to hear, mm -hmm. We are here to do Mama Land. It's been a while, Mama. <laughs> All this, oh, this group. Uh, so many things has happened to this group. We lost three members. Apparently, we lost two, but one of them is inactive because apparently, just because I think is what was her name? I know it's not Nancy. Oh, I forgot her name. But yeah, she wasn't the most good-looking girl in the group, but she is the most. Is one of the energy. She she's cute. Yeah, she's cute. She's cute. Um, let me just find her. Let me just. There we go. There we go. I think this is Daisy. I think this was Daisy that was. I don't know if she was kicked out or simply just. Is she just simply is not in the group? Is this Daisy? I think that that was her name, Daisy. Let me just see. Yeah, it's Daisy. So. So Teha and um, Youngwoo, Youngwoo literally left the group. I feel bad because they, they were such an amazing group together when they did uh, Bam Bam and uh, what was the other one? <laughs> Everyone was obsessed with their songs last year. Oh, it was Boom Boom. That was cool. That was cool. I just had to. So it was Bam and Bam and Boom Boom. They were the two songs that came out like two years ago, a year or two, and those were, what I mean bangers, those songs were bangers, they were booming in the world of K-pop, and for some reason, I don't know, what happened, and then all of a sudden, some some weird things were going on, I know Nancy's doing it, I know Yui, Jui, I loves me some Jui, Jui, <laughs> I love Jui. Jui's so cute. I love her personality. It's, it's, she's so, like she's like her energy is just like similar to J Hope from BTS because of her energy and the the funny as hell. I just love members like that in a group, especially in, that's a one thing I love about Mama Land. So with that being said, we're going to do Mama Land uh, thumbs up. So yeah, can't wait to see the rest of the members. I know the member, well, I think the leader is called Hyebin. Hyebin? Well, I'm reading from here. Hyebin, yeah, that's Hyebin. Hyebin. And the rest of them, no. I know who Nancy looks like, and I know Yui, of course, because Yui's everywhere. And she's adorable as hell. So, with that being said, we're going to do Mama Land's thumbs up in 3, 2, 1, go, go. They look so pretty. Wow. Oh, the notifications. They look so pretty. Look at Nancy! Yes! Look at her. She looks so pretty. She's always so pretty. Ah! Is that who I'm thinking it? Is that Yui? Is that my little it? Is that Yui? Let me have a look. Oh, she looks so pretty. I love her dress. That dress is everything. They look so pretty. Oh, there's my Yui. Oh, look at her. She's so pretty, so cute. People that say she's ugly, you, you need help. She's so adorable. It's the thing. You can't hate Yui. You can't hate the Yui. The Yui is adorable. Yes. <laughs> I love it. Absolute. You know what? They still got it. They still got. They still got the spark in their, in their music. Look at Yui. Yes, Yui. Get your shine on. Oh, everyone. I think Yui is the one that takes over the group, pretty much. Which one? Which one is here being? Because I know here being when she. When she did boom boom and bam bam, she was like her hair was really short. And now I don't know where she what she looks like now because she looks so different with her. If her hair is long, probably it's gonna be hard for me to find. The 
they're so cute. I love I love groups like that, like them. I love their little outfits. It's just like the black outfits and the red and yellow working outfit. It's so cute. It's just. I forgot his name, but I know he's really famous in Korea for like like preschools, kids, like toddlers. I love Nancy's makeup. That's so yeah, I can see why Nancy I, I now we now we understand why Nancy is the face of the group. I love I think that's Hyebin, the one with the black kind of like curly hair. This is giving me boom boom and bam bam. Yes, the Korean is similar to boom boom. Oh god, I love it. I absolutely, absolutely love this group. People who hate this group, you need help. Because apparently, uh, apparently they made fun of BTS Jimin, which was not true either. This group is just, they're getting hated on because <laughs> the people that are haters, they have no life. They, they have no talent. They waste their time 24 seven. So that's why they do, they say what they say on the internet all the time. But when I look at these groups, I mean, do you think it's just the Koreans? I have seen international fans being complete assholes. So, with that being said, no one is safe. No, my, not on my site, no one's safe. You think it's, oh, yeah, Koreans are screwed when it comes to me? No, nobody's safe because you also... There are, I've seen some international fans being completely, absolutely arseholes, especially from different fandoms, like like from, B, from BTS. I have seen some BTS fans and I've seen some Blinks from you know, Blackpink being attacking these, this group for no reason. For no reason, really. I'm like, really? Grow up. Grow up. So, okay. I really, really obsessed with this song right now. That, the whole choreo just gave me the boom boom. It gave me boom boom and bam bam. If you haven't seen boom boom or bam bam, go and watch it. Now you understand why I said I'm obsessed with it. It's so good. Mama Land is one. Mama Land is that group. Mama Land has not lost their spark. They still got their spark. <sighs> Thank God for this group. <laughs> and Yui, Yui looks like Yui. She's just so adorable. You people who think she's ugly, you must be. You're, 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 you're crazy and blind. Because this group, this is gold. That was golden. That was a golden moment for me. That was just amazing. The choreography, as always, it's just amazing. The song is catchy AF. Don't tell me any different. Oh my gosh. I, I'm just obsessed. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with the outfits. I'm obsessed with the hairstyle. Of course, I'm going to be saying I'm obsessed with Yui. Yui is everything. She's my bias, by the way. Of course. Nancy. Nancy. I love her makeup. Like her... Like, 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 she had like a kind of yellowy, kind of little bit of a purple, like, eye, like, eyeshadow on her eyes. It just looks so cute on her. It looks so pretty on her. Now I understand why she's the face of the group, because she's really pretty. And when you look at her, she doesn't look Korean. <laughs> For some reason, she looks mixed. But that could, that's, that's just me. I think she is mixed. Is she mixed or is she full on Korean? She has to be mixed because she doesn't look... So many notifications just popping up on my phone, it's ridiculous, okay. Yeah, Nancy, we just want to see Nancy. Nancy, I think Nancy was born in America, I think, on Australia, one of those two countries. Nancy Jewel McDonough, okay. Oh, she was born in South Korea, okay.
her parents. Yes, she speaks English and Korean, of course. So she did grow up in America. So she grew up in America. She was born in in, the, in South Korea, but she was she was raised in she was raised in a, um, in a, in USA. Okay, makes more sense. I do hope that Daisy comes back to, you know, to to the group. It makes no freaking sense of kicking her out because she's dating a guy. Because she's dating someone, I think. Oh, who's he dating? She's dating someone. One of them. Oh, he is. He's Yu Hyun. Yu. Is it? Is Yoon Hyun. Yoon Hyun from um, Icon. Yes. So she's dating him. And that's why they decided to kick her out. This is a bit dumb. And I understand it's because they're rookie groups, but come on, it's, it's not that serious. It's just dating. When I see like K pop idols dating, they're getting married and having children, I feel happy. Personally, I feel happy that they're doing that because this goes and shows how, how free they are. They're supposed to be free, they're supposed to be, you know. Like normal people, they don't. They're not trying to be. We don't want them to be like lonely people, and they die by themselves. Like most of the K-pop idols, we've seen them die alone. So people that are getting upset with K-pop idols dating or getting married or having children, guys, stop. This goes and shows how selfish you are. And one time, one of them passes away. Without getting married, without dating or anything, then you're just like, oh, my Anni, my Opa, my Nuna, oh, they passed away, and the Hyungs, guys, stop, stop. This, this is so, it's so fake and so hypocritical of you to say that, that you feel bad and you feel, I was like, I'm so sorry. What? Well, sorry for what? They're dead. So. Why are you apologizing? You should have apologized to them whenever they're like, when they were living, like in the flesh. It's like, hi, I'm here. No, you you decide to wait until they die, and then you say, oh yes, I love you, and I'm sorry. No, you're not sorry. This goes to show how hypocritical we, it's just hypocrites. Oh my god, a bunch of hip hypocrites. It's just, it goes for everyone. I, it's, it's not just Koreans. It's everyone. I've seen it. I've seen you guys, international fans, do the same shite. It's annoying. So, with that being said, I give it a 10 out of 10 because I love I love me some Mama Land. So, with that being said, I love you, everyone, and start on here.